It's Sharpley, one hopper, McNeil to Lindor, the relay to first. And Alonzo stays on the bag for the 4-6-3 double play. Beautifully done. Well, this ball was a rocket. And McNeil with a beautiful backhand. Ramos dunks that one into left field. Did McNeil make the catch? He did. Jeff McNeil. Well, he gets a good break on this. A little, little soft liner. And Jeff, you know, he's so athletic. He's just, uh, he's an athlete. He's it's sharp. He gets good instincts, good jumps on balls, whatever position he plays. When the Mets were constructed this year, they were constructed with pretty much the same offensive team they had last year. That's it sharply. Oh. McNeil with a gorgeous play and throws out Ruiz. How did he do that? An absolute seed on one hop. The ball was by him and somehow it stuck in Jeff's glove. Wow. Well, this team has a good, good defensive infield and he's got great hands. Beautiful backhand. He can pick it. Mm. My ball, shallow left center, on comes McNeil, sliding to make the catch. That was funny, Jeff deked on the way in as though he was trying to convince the runner that he was going to catch it, and that he actually did catch it. Well, in this tie game, he faces Stephen Kwan to lead off in the ninth. The 2-1 on the way, hit hard on the ground, up the middle, backhand stopped by McNeil, moving to his right, and he throws out Kwan, one man away. Beautiful play by Jeff McNeil. Line toward right. McNeil reaches out and makes the catch. Throws to oh, first right. for a double play. Jeff McNeil, as he stretched out to make the leaping grab, lost his footing for a moment but got back up in time to double up Real Muto. And he hits a roller toward the middle. On the backhand, McNeil, the off-balance throw, and he got him. Oh, wow, what a play. Jeff McNeil looked like a shore base hit, but McNeil scampering to his right and throwing at Schwarber. McNeil can. Uh -huh. and did get there. Nice catch. Wow. Looked like it had beaten him, and McNeil able to reach back and make the grab. To retire for Domo, two out. Wow, nice play. So the Diamondbacks are down to their final out. Then you have to trade them. That's lined, and McNeil makes the catch. Throws back to first, but Sanchez was back. And Falefa had to base it up the middle his first time up. And he lofts this one to shallow right. Coming on is McNeil going out as Mendick. McNeil oh. sliding and he made the catch. Now trying to score the throw to the plate. Alvarez with the tag. He saved. McNeil with a terrific sliding play with the bases loaded. This could have been really trouble and just a great recovery. Torres hits this one to deep right field. McNeil back to the wall this time and leaps and made the catch. Wow. He took a home run away from Torres. About Second that. time Glaber took aim at the short porch. Second time denied by McNeil. That's hit out to right center field. Hit well. Back goes McNeil in the gap and he makes a nice jumping catch. Hits the fence hard, tagging and going to third is Condelario, but a terrific play by McNeil to rob Kbert Ruiz of an extra base hit. One of the things I've always appreciated about Jeff McNeil's game is that he has no fear. Whether he's standing in there to take, try to turn a double play, or playing in the outfield with the wall. Right hand side, a little pace to it, but McNeil is on the case for out number two. Rodriguez with a grounder past Beatty down the third base line. Rodriguez with a big turn. He's making his way towards second. McNeil's throw. It is in time. Rodriguez bidding for extra bases. Cut down by Jeff McNeil. Love this on both sides of the ball, especially after the home run. J. Rock gets aggressive. He gives a peek up as he comes around first. He says, I'm going to test McNeil. And Neil does an awesome job throwing the one hopper. And Mauricio being able to pick that cleanly and understand where J. Rock was and where he was trying to attack on the bag as well. That was critical. With Xavier Edwards on deck. 
And that's rifled down the right field line, and that's a base hit for Chisholm. Cut off nicely by McNeil. Chisholm heads for second. The relay by Mauricio, oh. and Chisholm is a dead duck. McNeil made a fantastic play to cut that ball off before it got to the corner. And Mauricio with the quick relay, and they gun down Chisholm. And beautifully cut off by McNeil, and hits the cutoff man. Most important part of this play. And Chisholm makes a very, very poor choice. 2-2 two -two coming. And it's hooked in the air to shallow right. On comes McNeil, tagging at third Solaire. He is going to try it. The throw by McNeil on a hop, and he's out! McNeil with two outfield assists in the inning. Double play, and the side retired. Jeff McNeil making it happen. Well, quite an inning for Jeff McNeil. <laughs> I'll two say. outfield assists in one inning. Well, he had all the momentum coming for, and a perfect throw. It's lifted to right. Tough play for McNeil coming in and toward the line. He slides and he makes the catch and rolls over for good measure. Oh, and there you get a little bit of a t The field was so drenched. Remember, the outfield's never covered, and they've got the irrigation under, under the field to get the water to get out, but McNeil could have got hurt here. You know, the spike caught on the whip. I think it was the Earth. knee. Yeah, it was the knee. I, I, that is dangerous.